Hello everyone, my name is Heather and I'm the person behind Happy Puppy Truffles. Today I wanted to share with you an unboxing or unwrapping of a fun project that I found. And this is a selection of uh, little cute paper craft that make little dogs. And um, I was at the uh, bookstore in the big city and happened to see a huge display of all of these there. And I've seen some that were uh, made with more like origami paper and I was curious what these were like. And um, this is uh, all made by a, a designer called uh, Naoko Sato. And basically it's like a little um, postcard. It's really actually literally a postcard. The idea is that you can then send it to somebody if you want and then people can use these to make something if they prefer. Um, this is a set of five dogs. There's the bull, French Bulldog, a Dachshund, Welsh Corgi, Chihuahua, and a Dalmatian. And there's just a basic little kind of uh, uh, um, legend to let you know that how to assemble it and um, then just a basic kind of uh, process of putting it together. Um, and they had these all kind of on display and they all looked really cute and I thought, wow, you know, that's kind of a cool idea and I bet it'd be kind of fun to make. Now the ones I've done before, like I said, were with more like of an origami paper and they were pretty easy to use. They were pretty easy to put together. The instructions were pretty clear. Um, there was some nice numbering to go along to help you figure out what to do. And um, because the paper was really flexible, it was pretty easy to put together. I started trying to put together the French Bulldog and I just kind of got frustrated because, <laughs> and usually these things don't frustrate me that much, but it just, um, the paper's too thick and it doesn't bend well. And then there's these big lines the dotted lines where the fold should be, which really ruins the image for the animal, I think, personally. I don't know. I was kind of, I was really disappointed. Um, and I just kind of stopped because I didn't even want to bother putting it together. Um, you know, I think it could have been, you know, I understand and appreciate the idea that it's trying to be on a postcard, but um, it's just not the right medium for this. It works better if it's not something like this. And, you know, it, it being shiny and with the lines and everything, it would have been better if the lines could have been on the inside and then you could still fold and get the results that you need. Um, yeah, it was just really disappointing. So um, I didn't even bother finishing it. I was like, whatever. <laughs> didn't even want to bother. Um, and I, I just didn't even think they even really looked that fun. So it's just my personal opinion. I suppose if you're looking for a unique gift for somebody, if they happen to be a huge dog fan or they like paper craft, maybe something like this would be exciting to them. But it was still, it was expensive too. Um, this whole set here, there's just the five and it was 650 yen, which is like way more than it should be, I think. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I was kind of like, wow, this was really, really, really disappointing. So um, but like I said, I, I, you know, just a personal opinion on my part. I don't know if some of the others might be more, uh, a little easier to do, or uh, if you're more familiar with it, it might not be so bothersome, but, um, I wasn't that impressed with it and I thought it, the result really wasn't worth it. So that's why my little doggie is sitting here half made, not complete. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I mean, I guess I would say if you're, if you happen to see this video and you happen to see these at a store and you're questioning if you should get it or not, and you're not a huge, you know, really intense craft person who's done a lot of work with paper, uh, you probably don't want to do it. I certainly wouldn't want to buy it thinking you can do this with kids. They'll lose patience and be really upset and probably lots of tears will be there. So you probably want to avoid it if you have children. Um, and yeah, it's just my kind of opinion about this for sure. Definitely overpriced and just not very fun. So, um, yeah, I guess this is maybe one of the first times I've ever done a review where I was like really, really disappointed. So there you go. <laughs> I'll have some more things to share with you guys in the days to come. Thanks again always so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye.